Well, the new aspect that we're demonstrating here is the fact that all our sensors are smart, which means that they're equipped with a Modbus RS485 interface, making it possible to combine them all in one system with one wire to your computer, to your data logger, and hook them all up as, as one system. And tell us about the benefits that that provides. Well, the benefit that it provides is that uh, the sensors give much more information than just the radiation. They give status, they give their power supply, they give their uh, temperature. Uh, you can check what the calibration history is. All this information comes over the Modbus and is available per sensor. And it comes with, well, the digital interface that provides that. And the decision was to expand the, the range so that they were all available. Correct. Tell, tell yeah. us about that. Yeah. Now, we have uh, about four or five years experience with three of the sensors that are available already as smart ones, and it was successful. So we decided to expand the range. So now the complete product range is available as smart, which means that customers can combine them in one system with a tracker or with whatever device they need to be in one section with one wire connected to their system. And the fact that we trust the systems and, and the sensors as such. We give a five-year warranty on all of them. And with the full range of products, does that now mean there's a sort of flexibility to the types of installation and how people can use these sensors? Yes. Actually, a smart sensor is much easier to connect because they all have the same output. You don't have to uh, adjust the calibration factor of the instrument in your system because they're all, un all uh, identical. You just swap the sensor with a new one that's calibrated and uh, the system is running again. So it is very easy. And tell us about this exhibition and why this is such a, an important event for you. Well, uh, Kip Zonen has been manufacturing instruments for the meteorological market since 1930. So we're doing this uh, for almost uh, 100 years. Uh, and it means that um, the customers in the meteorology are asking for this type of sensors. We see that uh, most of the sensors are now equipped with a digital interface. And the fact that the radiation sensor now can be part of that makes it easier for them to connect it as, as one system and with the same type of interface as all the other ones that are uh, digitally available as well. And important for you to be here in Brussels to meet people from the industry and from different sectors that, that use these sort of systems? Exactly. Yes, especially, well, we, we are familiar with the market, but customers are not always aware of the, the latest technology that we are providing or looking for explanations or uh, new sensors that we provide. And this is a good way to show it. So in the meteorological market, we are well known, but uh, the fact that we can expose ourselves as, well, market leader and uh, the latest technology, that's a good opportunity, yes. And overall, what do you think of the expo? Well, uh, it's only the first day, but uh, so far it has been very busy. Uh, actually, uh, I haven't had uh, time to have a coffee, so that's, that's great. And uh, I hope it's uh, the same for uh, the next coming days.